scanning in ground anomaly and cavity mode, to be able to obtain the 3D graphs and the shapes of the detected targets in the search screen with the IP2 sensor, you must perform a scan. First, step away from the area where you get the target signal. Then, Press the scan button once and release. The device will switch to the scan screen. Different than the detection screen, the scan screen is a white, checkered ground. Press and hold the clear button. When you see the coil centered on the screen, release the button. By pressing and holding the scan button, swing the coil left to right slowly, and scan over the target, starting from a bit away from where the signal is starting and until the coil is completely off the target signal. The most important things you should pay attention to while scanning, are holding the search coil stable and parallel to the ground, and slightly overlapping each sweep with no gaps in between. When you first start scanning in the ground anomaly and cavity mode, the painting will be in red or blue for a short period of time. Then the painting will be done according to the metal type just like in the search screen. Once the scanning is completed, release the scan button. To go to the results screen, press the OK button. This is the graph of the cavity underground marked with a big square. And this is the graph of the metal underground, marked with the small square. And this is the graph of the small metal buried where we first started the scan.